Hey, what's shaking everybody? So today I got another fidget spinner video for you guys. It's been a while since I did a fidget spinner video and uh, a lot of you guys are subscribed for the fidget spinners and I feel like I got to give back because you guys have been awesome to me. I'm almost at 80,000 subscribers so thank you guys so much. So today I got two fidget spinners. These are both from lighttake.com. So there'll be links in the description if you want to pick these up. Uh, they're very affordable and they both look very nice. So let's adjust the camera, take a look at these babies, see what we got. Okay guys, so here are the two fidget spinners. This one comes in a nice soft pouch, while this one comes in a hard metal with a plastic clear shell. They both have stickers on them, you know, you can take that off if you want to keep this. Um, nice foam right there. Very, very cool. I like how it's got like the ridges, you know, ruffles have ridges, right? You know what I'm saying? Very cool feeling. Looks very cool when you turn it in your hand. Super, super cool. The caps work pretty good. You got a nice concave to them. Uh, it's got a very neat feeling weight distribution. But yeah, pretty cool. It's kind of looked like the ones they used on braille skateboarding when they put them on their skateboards. <laughs> but not quite. Yeah, very cool. Yeah, you got a nice weight to it for sure. But it's very thin. This one would be great to fit in your pocket. Like, I mean, that's like super thin. It's like thinner than your wallet. It's thinner than my pocket knife. Like, you know what I mean? Like, look at that. Even with the cap, it's still, you know, it's still shorter than it. So, very, very slim. Um, pretty cool. I like that. I really like that about that one. So, now this one. It's got a nice soft pouch, comes in a little bag, and this one's got a nice weight to it as well. Uh, these you can take off, so for, first let me get them all on there real good, but then I'll show you what I mean. Oh, this one's got really big, the, the bearing is larger, and the caps have a deeper concave, so it fits even better in your hands, like I'm trying to like move it on purpose. And it's still balancing really good. Like you want to go like really sideways. You know, very, very cool. It's got a really, a lot of weight on the rim. So very rim weighted, a lot of centrifugal force with this one. Feels very satisfying. But, yeah. So, but here's what I mean. Like you could take like, say you wanted it. One day you wanted to do it like this. Make it like a tri-spinner. Yeah, you could do that. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You can like change it up, you know. And that works good too. It's actually easier probably to flick it like this because you got like more room for your finger. So I mean, kind of customizable, pretty cool. I like it with the six though. It just looks. I just like it better with the six, but you know, teach their own. So if you want to take a couple off, take a couple off. Pretty pretty cool overall. Let's get these back on. We'll um, take a look at these bearings. See what we're looking at here. Yeah. Thanks again to LightTake.com for sending me these. And, yeah, thank you everybody that's been watching my videos. And, uh, just, yeah, just everybody. Just, whether you're a new subscriber, old subscriber, first time watching my video, thanks for watching. But, yeah, um, nylon cage bearing. Actually looks pretty, pretty damn nice, actually. Yeah, but these are some thick buttons, caps, whatever you want to call them. Yeah, super, I'm gonna get back on there, super nice. This one feels quite the nice quality. We're gonna give one of these away too. Um, the way I'm gonna do it is, um, we're just gonna, you know, I'll put all the rules at the end, but I'm just gonna have the winner gets to pick which one they want. So if you like this one better, you can have that one, or whatever, so whatever. I'll tell you how to win at the end of the video, but this one's caps a little harder to take off. Um, smaller bearing, like the R188 size bearing. Uh, still enclosed in there, quite nice though. And uh, the caps, you know, are anodized on both sides, so very cool. So, yeah. Oh, well, let me screw these back together. Let's go in the kitchen where it's not so bright. We'll put my phone out. We'll play some some uh, instrumental music, and uh, we'll see how long these babies spin for right out of the box. Okay, let's see how long they spin right out of the box. Let's give it the old flick of the wrist, hit the button, play some music, have a good old time, and I'll see you when it's done.
So we got 4.10 for this one, and 2 minutes for this one. So, yeah. I was actually expecting this one to spin a lot because how heavy it is, and how it just feels, you know, when you spin it regularly in your hand. But, yeah, the circular design is uh, quite efficient, apparently. So, very cool. Alright guys, thanks for watching. For your chance to win either one of these fidget spinners, all you're going to have to do... Alright guys, thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video. For your chance to win either one of these fidget spinners, all you're going to have to do is make sure you're subscribed to my channel. Have your subscription set to public so I can make sure. And uh, yeah, just comment something. That's all, that's all there is to it. Real simple today. But yeah, I'll pick somebody at random in about a week and I'll just pin it. I'll put a comment and I'll pin that comment at the top. So... You know, if you're subscribed and you can give you leave a content comment, just make sure you check in about a week or so. And uh, yeah, the winner will be up there. So, thank you guys for watching. Thanks again for Light Take for sending me these. Make sure to check them out. Links in the description. And until next time, I'll see you later.